Thursday and we're at the Cooper Fields for a quarter-final match in the mixed division between Great Britain and New Zealand. Both of these teams are real contenders in this division. New Zealand in the stack here, McDonald with the disc. Throws it deep, he's got Valetic. Van Cleef's in a good position though. And Valetic comes down with the disc. Van Cleef couldn't get the D. Nice catch. Scores 7-4 to New Zealand. They've only sent one team to the Worlds in Turkey. They've decided to pool all their resources into the mixed division. Pockington throws a swing hammer. McCollin with the disc. Puts it up to Whitehouse. Whitehouse throws deep. But it's sailed out of bounds. Poor execution on the throw, but you might also call into question the decision to make that throw. Buckingham throws it to Rigby. Arnie across the front of the zone and catches the score. McCollin couldn't get there. The score is 8 4 to New Zealand. Letic. Vivison's trying to get a throw out. Throws a high release. Vant misread it. <laughs> Glass towed the line well. Caught the disc. 9 4 to New Zealand. Easter to Mitchell. New Zealand playing zone. Swing to McCollin. Back to Mitchell. Mitchell hucks. Whitehouse is underneath it. Read it well and called the disc just on the line. Difficult path to be running underneath the disc, so that was a very good catch. Great Britain pull another point back. 9 5 to New Zealand. Biletic. Marked by Bevan. Puts it up the line to Jarvis. Rigby up the line, throws a hammer across the front. Scarlet with the score. New Zealand take a 10-5 lead. The style of play in the mixed division is quite different than open or women's. So it'll be interesting to see how these teams play and what strategies they use. Mitchell comes to the disc, picks it up. Bolton cuts across the field, gets the disc, eludes the bid. Throws it to Polkingthorne. Up the line to Smith. Good pressure from New Zealand. Moore. Trying to work an opening to get the disc out. Dump to Pocklington. Swing to Easter. Easter with the disc up the field to Moore. Throws it into the zone. On a great layout grab, Bolton takes the disc at the back of the end zone, worked really hard to get there, and made a great layout grab at the end. Here we see Bolton working hard, get the disc. He's so near the beginning of the point, he leads the marker, throws it up the line. Clears out immediately, get back into position to make a play downfield. He's always reacting, judging the spaces, looking to see where the openings are. Always trying to cut off the back of his marker. He was guarded in the whole time, so he's able to get the disc deep. And here's the catch. Yoink! It's a nice grab. Told you Muppet Cam would be good. Scores now 10-6 to New Zealand. GB bringing it back to only four points. Jarvis with the disc. Gets it upfield to Simpson in a lot of space. Break backhand to Vant. Vilatic. Back to Jarvis. He's even just maintaining possession. Vulitic no 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 no. comes forward. Nice bid from Hims. Not successful. Puts it up towards Vant. Van Cleef's there. Van Cleef comes from behind. Makes up the ground and gets the D. Player cam on Van Cleef. Judging the disc and his man. Sees the throw goes up. Knows he's got good jumps. Times his jump and goes and D's it. Hibbert with the disc, Van Cleef moving, cuts straight away, cuts deep, grabs the disc, 
It looks like a foul. Van Cleef about to get the disc back. Throws it into space. Levy towards the disc, but doesn't make it. Couldn't make the ground. Jarvis with the disc, right on the cone. And New Zealand is setting up their horizontal offense with a cut coming in early. Jarvis to Simpson. Backhand throw to Vletic. Hims with the layout D. Hebert with the disc. Swings but throws it into the ground. Vletic runs to the disc, marked by Hims. Swing to Van Berkel, puts it up the field. High side arm towards Vant. Vant comes down with it just outside the zone. Dump to Jarvis. Van Berkel runs through for the score. A little shovel pass inside from Jarvis. Several turnovers. GB had the chance to bring it within three, so that was a very pivotal point. Now it's a five point lead for New Zealand. New Zealand playing the zone. Another swing. Pocklington on the disc now. Swing hammer. Some more. Polking Thorn catches it down low. Immediately throws it back to Moore. He's got Mitchell for the swing. Oh, and he doesn't even make that far. McDonald picks the disc up. Thomas cutting back towards the disc. Catches it on the line. Beat her marker in there. Pass inside to Rigby. Rigby throws it to the middle of the field to Sanders. Rigby cuts again, gets the disc. And an easy break, easy score for Arnie. Scores now 12-6 to New Zealand. GB call a timeout. Well, GB has really been wasteful with the disc. Haven't been executing well. And the defense is getting a little bit slow now. They're following the men around. Really need to turn things around here at the end of the game. Van Cleef checks the disc in. New Zealand playing the zone. He's giving it to Hughes. Swing to Bevan. Back to Van Cleef. Van Cleef faking well, trying to get a throw out. Throws it towards the zone. Vletic comes across, off man and gets the D. Hughes thinks he has it here, but Vletic sneaks in. Great D, good poach. Vletic back to the line, throws to Vant. Vant to Asaf Nujem. Throws it to Vletic, Vletic hucks. He's got Van, Van Cleef is trailing. And Van comes down with a score near the back line. Easter with the disc. Puts it inside to Mitchell. Mitchell pings it. Hulking Thorn underneath it. He's got three of a marker and grabs the disc. Dump to Whitehouse. Whitehouse pivoting, throws a low backhand. Gone to Mitchell. Mitchell throws a hammer to Bolton for the score. Made sure of the catch. Very safe catch. 14 7 to New Zealand. Vletic with the disc. Him's marking him again. Asaf Nujem to Thomas. Lee pass down the line. Overthrows to Asaf Nujem. Him's with the disc. New Zealand playing his zone or a clam. O'Kane with the disc now. Looking for a pass out. Throws a swing to Hims. Hims puts it inside, but it's eaten up by the New Zealand D. Jarvis cuts from behind, gets the disc. Vletic is wide open. Wide open for the score. Hims knows he made a mistake there. The D team gets the disc again, but can't convert it. And GB are digging a hole here. They really need to sort out their possessions on offense. Mitchell with possession, inside to Moore, Moore sends it deep, looking for Gardner. Great catch, you came inside to get it, it was underthrown. Looking for the dump, throws it towards Mitchell, but Mitchell can't get there. McDonald picking the disc up, New Zealand stacked all on one side, Glass comes across. Back to McDonald. Throws it into the zone for Glass. 
Oh, I made Glasgow and fetched the disc for the score, but it was a really nice pass. Score is now 16 7 to New Zealand. And they're really punishing GB deep, taking advantage of that marking in with little throws over the top deep. New Zealand one point away from the semi final now. Mitchell underneath the pool. New Zealand come down in the zone. Mitchell throws a few fakes, then throws a swing to Pocklington. Pocklington with a hammer towards Easter. Easter with a nice safe catch. And a swing to Mitchell. New Zealand's still in the zone. Mitchell puts the disc deep. He's looking for Whitehouse. Whitehouse has got Sanders on him, but Van Burkle comes across with a great layout D. Whitehouse has a lot to make up here, but he thinks he can get there. But Van Burkle just works so hard to get back for this disc. Great D. Whitehouse had beaten his man. Scarlet with the disc. Dumped to Carlisle. He took advantage of the GB defender not looking. Throws to Skipper. Underneath to Sanders. Sanders with a fake and a punt long to Van Burkel, but I don't think he's going to get that. Mitchell comes back to pick up the disc. New Zealand still playing zone D. Swing to Easter. A dump back to Mitchell. Mitchell puts the disc up again. He's got Whitehouse. Doesn't look like that's going to come in. Oh, that's a nice grab. Is that in? Mitchell from his own end zone launches the disc with a big backhand. Here comes Whitehouse. Full extension, catches it, lands in for the score. What a great catch. We weren't sure whether that was in, but that's definitely a point to GB, bringing the score back to 16-8. Van Cleef with the pull. Nice deep pull. Rigby catches the pull. Underneath comes Buckingham. Rigby finds him. Just a swing into the middle to Thomas. Swings again to Glass. Glass dumps to McDonald. McDonald puts it deep. Glass and Davidson, but Cuthbertson and Van Cleese are there. GB get the turnover. Pew with the disc. Dump to Bevan. Yeah, but trying to fake. Gets a nice break out, a nice swing to Bevan. Back to Pew. towards Collier but it's overthrown and Buckingham gets the D. Van Cleef couldn't pick up the swill. Rigby runs to pick up the disc. Throws deep. He's got Glass underneath it and Glass scores. New Zealand win the game and advance to the semi-finals. And here again in the last point GB was able to come up with a D. Couldn't convert it. New Zealand got it back and scored and this time it's for the game. New Zealand win the game. Great Britain, European champions, really couldn't find their game today. They had too many turnovers on offence and New Zealand advanced to the semi-finals. I'm sure New Zealand will be hoping to do well through the rest of the tournament. Congratulations on your win just now. Thank you very much. How did you manage it? Uh, hard D, running hard and some good strategy from our coach. It's great having a coach here this year. Excellent. Do you not usually have that then? No, I normally have a player coach, but we've got a dedicated sideline coach, so that's really good. It's a whole group of people that come together and we're very strong together as a team. Any teams you've learned a lot of? Uh, Belarus. They've got great spirit. It was great to see them here for their first world champs. Who are you playing in the semi-finals? Pretty sure we're playing Canada in the semi-finals. That should be a tough one. What are you going to do in order to make sure that you come out on top? Well, 
pretty much we want to crush them. So we'll just go out hard and see what comes of it. Do you have any technical play that you usually use? or? Uh, well, yeah, we've got lots of strategies. Uh, we've got a very big toolbox, so we'll just be going hard and throwing things at them and see how they cope with it.